for the white team number 16, Max Domi. Max Domi is the son of former NHL enforcer Ty Domi, one of the top young players on the Arizona Coyotes and a type 1 diabetic. I was diagnosed with type 1 diabetes when I was 12 years old and um, so eight years ago now and I uh, didn't really know a whole lot about it and uh, I obviously was in the hospital for quite a long time and, and saw a special one, this guy named Bobby Clark who uh, was this tough guy, he was worth the, worth the cap, uh, he was the CE for uh, Philadelphia Flyers and he was a type 1 too so I mean it's definitely a guy that I looked up to and is a role model in my life as, as a type 1 diabetic and as a hockey player so I uh, changed my number to 16 and uh, haven't looked back since. Type 1 diabetics are insulin dependent, meaning the pancreas does not produce enough insulin to regulate blood sugar. Because of that, Domi wears an insulin pump while playing. Nurse practitioner Pam Akers explains how the device works. It uses rapid acting insulin, so a little bit of insulin goes in all the time, which is called the basal insulin. And then when you eat carbohydrates, or you're going to eat whatever food, then you count the carbohydrates and you put that number in the pump. And then the pump boluses a little bit more insulin to cover for that meal. Akers herself is a type 1 diabetic, and her pump actually went off during the interview. That's a pump beeping. <laughs> That's my pump beeping. She says that being diabetic requires diligence. This is a lifestyle that Domi knows all too well. You know what, it's, it's not a whole lot different than other pro athletes because, I mean, pro athletes are different than your average person. I mean, your, your preparation, your, your diet and, and everything along those lines is, is uh, I mean, pretty sharp and, you, and you, there's not a whole lot of room for error. But uh, maybe just a little tighter for me in a sense that there's a couple other things I got to do. But, uh, you know, today it's, it's just part of my lifestyle and haven't changed a whole lot. Another key to Domi's lifestyle is his diet. According to Dr. Harmeet Narula of Banner Health, it involves balancing your portions. I think type 1 diabetes um, sometimes in the beginning may be a bit challenging because it forces you to think about what you're eating. Half of that plate should come from a non-starchy vegetable, a quarter from a lean protein, and that lean protein may be chicken, turkey, fish, etc. And the other quarter is a starch. It is important to keep in mind that those portion sizes change with more physical activity. In fact, Dr. Narula encourages those with diabetes to be active. And Domi feels having diabetes will not hold him back. I usually don't really like to talk about the challenges, to be honest, because, I mean, challenge is whatever you make it out to be. I mean, if, if you look at it as a negative, then it's going to, I mean, impact you in a negative way. But uh, if you spin it into a positive, it's, it's going to be nothing but push you forward. So um, challenges usually try and put those into my back pocket and, and make me better in the end of the day. So uh, that's how I... Look at that stuff. Sporting number 16, you can catch Domi taking the ice and pushing through it all. In Glendale, Allison Cummings, Cronkite News.